Welcome to Pronto Wash's Technician's Training. This video is to help you understand the techniques we use at Pronto Wash. These techniques are designed to get the highest and best use of the Pronto Wash system. This video will help instruct you on all aspects of washing, waxing, and detailing the client's vehicle. These techniques are proven to be effective and help maintain a high level of quality to keep your customers coming back week after week. So let's get started. Before we begin the wash process, let's review the equipment we'll be using. First is the Mobile Detailing Unit, or MDU. In the back of the MDU is a 12-volt battery that supplies power. This battery powers a pump which removes the solution from the bottom portion of the MDU to the low-flow atomizer gun on the top. The opening to fill the tank is located directly behind the top portion, or hood, where the cleaning supplies are kept. Some newer MDUs come equipped with a brake, like the one demonstrated here. The brake will keep the cart from rolling down inclines. Underneath the hood of the MDU is the hose and the low-flow atomizer gun. Next to the gun is the tire dressing and various spray bottles. Beginning with the spray wax, fender dressing, shampoo, the degreaser, and the window cleaner. Behind these bottles are the air freshener, the leather and vinyl conditioner, the pad for applying leather conditioner, the pad for applying cream carnauba wax, a mosquito sponge, a clay bar, microfiber towel, and on the opposite side, the tire dressing applicator. The next piece of equipment is the water filter proportioner system. Water flows through the first stage filter where the minerals are removed. The water continues to the second stage filter which removes all solids and metals. Finally, the filtered water goes through the proportioner which correctly proportions the water with the Miracle Lotion. The yellow product shown here on the cart is our Miracle Lotion used in all our car washes. Through the proportioning system, it is diluted 32 to 1 and stored in the bottom tank of the MDU. Next is the leather and vinyl conditioner. This product is not diluted and is applied directly onto the leather and vinyl to be cleaned. Then the cream carnauba wax is what we use to hand wax the vehicles. This product can be used indoors or outdoors. The carpet shampoo is used, just as it says, to clean carpets, mats, upholstery, and stain removal. Our spray wax will bring a shine to the vehicle, but it won't last as long or protect from UV rays as well as the carnauba wax. The window cleaner needs to be diluted 50 to 1 before using it to clean windows. Pronto Wash offers three air fresheners. They are new car, baby powder, and leather. For underneath the fender, there is the Miracle Fender dressing in the green color. It should only be applied to the fender, not to the car body. The orange colored concentrate is our degreaser. It needs to be diluted 4 to 1 before use. It's used to clean rims and take mosquitoes from the metal of cars. Finally, the Miracle Scratch Out removes scratches that don't have to be buffed out with a machine. Before the technician begins, it's important to remember he should not be wearing earrings, necklaces, rings, watches, belt buckles, or any metals that could scratch the surface of the vehicle. Now we're going to start by cleaning the under fender, tire, and rim area. This is the first important step in the washing process. The first step to begin the wash process is to remove the low flow atomizer gun and extend the hose completely. To clean the under fender, tire, and rim area, you will need the degreaser spray bottle, the fender brush, a used microfiber towel, and finally the fender dressing. Using the fender brush, clean the interior, under fender, or wheel well of all accumulated debris and dirt. When completed, apply Miracle Fender dressing to the same area using the plastic spray bottle applicator. Be sure it's applied to all the viewable areas. 
Next, spray small amounts of Miracle Lotion onto the rim, followed by some degreaser. Then with a used microfiber cloth, wipe the area of dirt, grease, and debris. Be certain to clean all areas and angles on the rim. Adjust your viewing position often to check for areas you might have missed. As a final step of the rim cleaning, spray a little more Miracle Lotion and shine the rim. With the same microfiber cloth, detail the edge of the wheel well to make sure it's free of debris. Using a tire dressing applicator, apply Miracle Tire Dressing in a clockwise motion to the entire tire to achieve an even and brilliant shine. Repeat the process on the other three tires. The next step in the washing process is to remove all the bugs, tar, and road debris from the exterior portions of the vehicle. For bug removal, we're going to use the mosquito sponge, the degreaser, a microfiber cloth, and the Miracle Lotion. Spray small amounts of Miracle Lotion to the vehicle where the bugs are present then soften the bugs with degreaser applied to the same areas. Using the mosquito sponge, remove bugs from the surface. The next step is to wash the exterior of the vehicle in teams of two. This will ensure the best results possible. To begin cleaning the exterior of the vehicle, Fold a new microfiber cloth in four sections, then dampen it sufficiently to slide over the surface of the car. One technician sprays the vehicle and washes it with a dampened cloth. He is followed by another technician with a dry cloth who dries the vehicle. Be sure no water hits the ground when spraying the vehicle. If the vehicle is taller than the technician, be sure and use the two-step ladder for your safety and also to not scratch the vehicle. The average time for an exterior car wash is between 12 and 15 minutes. Whenever drying the vehicle, be sure you're not touching any other part of the vehicle with your hand or your body, like the technician shown here. As you wash the car, refold the microfiber cloth often to maintain a clean surface. Repeat this procedure for the opposite side of the vehicle. The next step in the washing process is the exterior and interior window cleaning process. To clean the windows, use the blue microfiber towel and the Miracle Window Cleaner. Spray a small amount of cleaner onto the surface of the window or mirror and wipe it dry with the blue microfiber cloth. The technician uses the cleaner to retouch the windows to ensure no marks are left on the windows or mirrors. Once finished, the technician will put away all the items on the mobile detailing unit. This is the final portion of the exterior wash, therefore the technician should take one minute to check and verify no details left undone. Details such as marks, no unwashed sections, and special note to carefully look on the lower parts, mirrors, and windows. The next step in the cleaning process is the interior door jams of the vehicle. Be sure to clean the door jams and the doors all around the frame of the vehicle. This is the first area the customer notices upon returning to their vehicle. The next step in the process is the interior cleaning and vacuuming. The first step in cleaning the vehicle's interior is vacuuming the floorboards,
cup holders and console, being careful not to scratch any surface. When vacuuming the seats, press on the edges to open up the seams. This allows for the best possible cleaning method in the stitching. After cleaning both the driver's and passenger's side of the front, switch to the rear. From the back seat, vacuum as far under the front seat as possible, then return the front seat to its original position. If the mats are extremely dirty, remove them from the vehicle to be brushed and then vacuumed. After vacuuming, the next step is to dampen a microfiber towel and clean the dash, dashboard, steering column, and wheel. Turn signal switches, gear shift, and instrument console, cleaning all visible compartments. Most important, check the ashtray and clean it if necessary. Never leave the keys in the ignition or open the glove compartment or center console. Next, wipe down the door panels, including all compartments in the panels. Repeat the process throughout the entire vehicle. Finally, clean the interior windows with a blue microfiber towel and Miracle window cleaner. Start with the front window and rear view mirror and continue until all the windows are clean. Do your best to return the mirrors to their original position. The next step in the process is the shampooing of carpets, mats and interior upholstery. When shampooing the carpets the technician will use the special detailing unit. Using this low flow atomizer gun he applies the Miracle Carpet shampoo evenly to the surface. The technician then uses the carpet brush to clean the upholstery, removing any spots. Finally, using a microfiber towel, he dries the area as best as possible. This process can be repeated until the spot is removed. You can use this product anywhere there is carpet, such as seats, carpeted door panels, and ceiling liners. The next step is the application of vinyl and leather protectant. The first step in conditioning the leather is to clean it with a shampoo and a brush. The technician should then wipe the leather dry with a microfiber towel. Then apply a small amount of conditioner, either to the pad or to the seat itself, and work into the leather with circular motions.
Let the conditioner sit for two or three minutes and dry with a microfiber cloth to smooth out and dull the conditioner. This brings out a showroom finish to the leather, helping it to breathe and look like new. The technician will know when this task is completed when there are no shiny parts. The last step in the interior cleaning process is the application of air freshener. To apply the air freshener, remove from the MDU the type the customer has selected, either new car, baby powder, or leather. The technician merely applies a small amount to the floorboard in the front and rear of the vehicle. We are now going to show you how to apply Miracle Spray Wax to the exterior of the vehicle. Miracle Spray Wax can only be applied after the vehicle has been washed. The technician sprays the wax onto a portion of the vehicle and with a microfiber towel he spreads the wax over the vehicle. Taking a dry towel he then brings out the shine of the vehicle. The spray wax acts as a protectant against UV rays, dust and acid rain. We will now show you how to apply the Miracle Clay Bar process to the exterior of the vehicle. This picture demonstrates the effects of acid rain on the surface of a car. It can also represent tree sap or dust that adheres to the paint surface over time. The process to remove these effects is the clay bar procedure. The technician takes the clay out of its container, being sure it's moist. He shapes it into a circle before use. Next, he applies spray wax to the vehicle. And then begins moving the clay bar in a straight line back and forth across the vehicle. Repeat until the clay bar slides easily across the surface of the vehicle. Lastly, take a microfiber cloth and apply pressure to bring out the shine from the vehicle. We are now going to show you how to apply Miracle Carnauba Wax to the exterior of the vehicle. When hand waxing a vehicle, the technician moistens the hand wax applicator with Miracle Lotion. and applies the cream carnauba wax directly to the applicator. He will also apply the wax to a portion of the vehicle. Using a circular motion, the technician covers the vehicle with carnauba wax. Little force is needed to apply the wax. The important thing is to cover 100% of the vehicle. Another significant issue is to only apply the carnauba wax after the car has been washed and after any clay bar procedure. The wax should dry in about one minute after application. If used outside, it will dry faster as well as if the air is warmer. The dry wax should be removed with a clean white microfiber towel. Fold the towel in four sections and with the same circular motion remove the wax from the surface of the vehicle.
Be sure to remove wax from any black plastic portions of the vehicle. The wax will turn white on these portions of the vehicle in a short period of time. Continue folding the towel to keep a clean area. This brings as much shine out of the metal as possible. We are now going to show you how to remove light scratches from the exterior of the vehicle using Miracle Scratch Remover. The Miracle Scratch Remover is very easy to apply. Simply pour some onto an applicator and cover the scratch. Rubbing in the direction of the scratch, work the Miracle Scratch Remover in and wipe off the excess. Finally, use a white microfiber towel to bring out the shine. This process also works with road tar, as demonstrated here. We hope you enjoyed this training. Keep in mind that the quality work that you do as technicians is in direct proportion to the satisfaction of our customers. Like in any business, our success and your success depend on happy customers. Again, welcome to the Pronto Wash family and good luck.